City Comptroller Brad Lander. Yeah. Thank you. Where's the money? <laughs> we'll get to it. Good afternoon. Uh, first of all, I just want to say that I'm really humbled to be here in solidarity and to listen to all these powerful, painful stories. It's not easy for folks to get up here and tell the stories of their own pain and their families hurt. Um, so let's just hear it one more time for all those folks who have had the guts to come out and make sure that what happened to their families, to their friends and their communities are something other people see and have to be held accountable to. And we're humbled by it. We are also so tired of having to come out time and time again. It's only the first month of the year, and yet this is the third vigil for uh, a, you know different victims of anti-Asian hate. Yesterday, I was at Michelle Goh's wake, and I spoke to her father and her mother and her brother, and I know a lot of you were at her vigil in Times Square. Last week, we had a vigil for Yapan Ma, who was attacked last year and then died at the very beginning of this year. And then here we are today for Vicha, listening to all these other stories. It is just, it's hard to live in a city with this much hate of people based just on who they are. Um, it's hard to live in a city with so many people who don't have a place to live with the lack of mental health care um, where we can't show up for each other. So I want to speak to you just for one minute as a Jewish New Yorker and say to my Asian brothers and sisters, my Asian neighbors, to Asian New Yorkers, this is your city. It belongs to you as much as it belongs to yeah. anyone else. And you know, Jews were uh, immigrants to this city. And of course, there continues to be anti-Semitism and hate crimes against Jews. But no one doubts for a minute that New York is a Jewish city. Our foods have become New York foods. Our ways of being have become New York ways of being. Jewish New Yorkers are New Yorkers. New York is a Jewish city. And of course, every one of those things is true about Asian American New Yorkers. And there's no doubt, as we're here on Fred Korematsu Day, thinking about what the differences are, that it is because Jews are white, and we have not found a way to lean into the idea of genuinely inclusive multiracial democracy, but it is our only path forward. That is the city we can build together. You know, Yao Pan Ma, before he came to this country, was a dim sum chef. And dim sum is Chinese food, but there's no food more New York than dim sum. Dim sum is New York food. And if we could build a city that genuinely reflects the kind of inclusive multiracial democracy that is all our communities thriving and contributing and being able to stand in solidarity with each other and create and start businesses and uh, teach our cultures in our schools, that is the New York that could come out of this pandemic stronger and more vibrant and more resilient and more equal. That is the future we want to be able to hand off to our kids. So I am here today to pledge, both as your comptroller and as a Jewish New Yorker, solidarity so we don't have to be back here again. One thing I'm going to make sure we're doing is providing the resources that are designated for our AAPI-led nonprofits to make sure they get to you on time so you don't have to wait a year yes. or a year year and a half before you even get the money two years so that is a problem we could at least solve and make sure those resources which we're still not providing enough of at least get in the hands of our nonprofit and our community-based organizations yes. on time because we won't have an inclusive multiracial democracy where people don't have housing where people don't have mental health care where people don't have the health care that they need where they can't start small businesses where they aren't supported so let's make sure we're all supporting each other Thank you to the organizers. Let's keep showing up for each other. Let's make sure that the resources get to our neighborhoods and let's build that inclusive multiracial democracy that all Asian American New Yorkers and all New Yorkers deserve. Thank yes. you.